Hello everyone, this is Chris from KnockInnovation.com. Uh, today I'm going to take a look at a new app which has recently been released. I think it just hit the market yesterday. It's actually only available for Windows Phone 8.1 devices. So if you are still on um, 8.0, then unfortunately you won't be able to install it. It is Files, published by Microsoft Corporation. Um, Files is a free app for managing files on your Windows phone. By using this app, you can access files stored on your phone and SD card, browse, search, and launch files, easily share one file or multiple files, create folders to organize your files, copy, move, rename, and delete files. I will take a quick look at it. It's version 1.0 at the minute. It's very new. Although a few weeks back, we did hear Joe Bell Fury talk about it on Reddit. So let's take a look. It does have a live tile, which gives you small and medium. Uh, and as of yet, there's nothing particularly live about it. There it is on the menu. If you have a SD card in your phone, then it will give you the option to search either your phone or the SD card. It tells you what storage you've got left. Um, sorry, what storage you've used and what you've got left on both. The first view you get of it is pretty much what you see when you plug your phone into a PC. For example, you get documents, downloads, music, pictures, ringtones, and videos. All my stuff installs automatically to the SD card. As you can, as it said in the description you can launch applications for example videos i'll try playing this brave it's not a particularly good video player as in you can't do they call that scrubbing track scrubbing on music but you can skip forward 30 seconds or so using that button You are able to move files from, say, the phone memory to the SD card. It's a bit slow. We'll, we'll try and move a 178 megabit file. Uh, you can either do that by long pressing, or you can use these icons at the bottom. Uh, we'll select move to. And from here, you can navigate using these little things at the top. It's a bit slow, but so we go home, SD card, videos, move here. And then moving one of one item, it takes a little while, like I said. But it does get there eventually. Um, the new improvements to Windows Phone 8.1 web browser means you can now download pretty much any file from the web using Internet Explorer 11. And that normally knows where you want to move these files to as to know where which folder to save it to. For example, I downloaded a music track from uh, listen to youtube.com. If you're not familiar with that website, you can put in the URL of a YouTube video and it will it'll save the audio as an MP3 track. So we'll find that on the SD card. Music, and as you can see down the bottom, it's an Oasis track, but it's got all the percent, dash, percent, 20 percent, dash in the title. So we'll long press it, rename it. Uh, one thing to be wary of if you are renaming an MP3 file, you do want to keep dot MP3 at the end. Right, 
the importance of being idle and here it is You are also able to share images, to share files. So let's see, we'll select the couple. And there's the share icon, preparing content to share. And you're then given the options. Um, I don't have some apps on here, but if I had Facebook on there, then no doubt it would allow me to share it through Facebook. There it goes, it automatically puts these files into your phone. I think that's very good. Uh, like I said, it's only available for Windows Phone 8.1. Uh, and I also found if you go into the store and you actually search for files, it doesn't automatically come up. I'll show you what comes up when you search files. A whole host of other ones. Don't be f fooled by that one, which is 99p. It actually looks like quite a good app, but it isn't the one we're after. If you want to find a link for this, if you want to find a link for Microsoft's app, you can go to our website. And it will be at the bottom of our article. Um, we'll also put a link in the video description on YouTube and on our website. Uh, any questions on files or any other apps, please don't hesitate to ask. Uh, I'm Chris for Nokiainnovation.com. Thanks for watching. Bye.